can't, when I paint, there was a then, I should have... The letter said that the accident happened on the 15th of May, 8.30 p.m. I wonder if... Yes. There are videos on there for the 15th of May. Here. 15th of May, 8 to 9 p.m. You're leaving? Yes. Where to? To work. Don't lie to me. You're going to see her, aren't you? Oh, not this again. Tell me straight up at least. Helena. If you leave now, you don't have to come back at all. <laughs> you can stay at her place. But I'm curious about how you're going to live without my parents' money. Huh? It would be hard to continue your oh-so-important research without it. You would have to work as a waiter or as a cleaner, but no. <laughs> that would be beneath you. <laughs> You're made for more, aren't you? <laughs> I never asked for your parents' money. No, <laughs> of course not. You didn't accept the money until my parents practically forced you to take it. Please, Mr. Schreiber, marry our sick daughter. You're so good for her. She's so much more stable since you came into her life. Please, calm down. Do you think you're the only one who can sleep around? I had sex all the time. Hot, rough, steamy sex with any man I could find. Please don't go. Emma. Hold me, please. I... Emma. I... Let's go. Oh no. Anna? Are you there? Who are you? I can't. I've listened to a recording of a woman having a fatal accident. This woman had my voice. Not a similar voice, but exactly mine. I don't know how all of this could be possible, but if it means that I am Elena, that somehow her and me are the same person, then I've just witnessed my own death. So stop making excuses and give it to me straight. Yes, Elena is the woman on the recording. But you're not the same person, although you are somewhat similar. What do you mean, similar how? Anna, what is it that Leonard actually does at the Institute? I mean, what is his research on? He tries to understand how the human brain works, what makes intelligence, character, consciousness, that kind of thing by recreating human thinking in a computer simulation. You mean... He did it, Anna. You can't be serious. He created artificial life, Anna. Only, there were consequences he didn't see coming. But where is he? Find a way out, and you'll find Leonard. <laughs>
the hell? The door has been boarded up from the outside. Nothing I can do. can't be possible. A stairway? In my storage room? Is this blood? A lot of boxes. Wonder what's in there. Looks like Leonard's stuff. Laboratory equipment. Some even with electrodes. Sometimes I think he might be Frankenstein. Anna? When you break through the door, you'll find Leonard. But you won't be able to come back. Are you sure that's what you want? He is my husband. I want to hear it coming from him. Good. One more thing. Out there, I probably won't be able to help you. You'll be on your own. Good luck. Oh my god. Where am I? Hello? Hello, Anna. Who are you? I am the computer system. Is there something I can do for you? Where am I? You are at the home of Leonard Schreiber. Leonard! I want to talk to him. Leonard is currently at the office. But I've already sent him a message informing him that you have woken up. As soon as he replies, I will let you know. How about you make yourself more comfortable, Anna? You have no access permission for this interface, Anna. An error occurred. Who? Leonard? Hello, Anna. You are old. All of this must be a lot for you to process. Why are you old? Well, you were ill. And, and why I... was I in this container? I did this for you. For many years, you've been in a, a coma. In a coma? Yeah. What a load of crap, Leonard. Then why are you old while I'm young? I think you're lying. You're lying, and you only want to distract from what's really going on. I don't know why and how, but you've created some sort of clone of me. Who, who told you that? Didn't you? Elena is the name you gave her. And when she didn't comply with what you wanted, you... You killed her? Give me one good reason to not go to the police right now and tell them everything that I know. Go ahead. I don't think the system will let you out. I have locked all exits. The building is now on lockdown. You see? You've changed. We're lovers. Doesn't that count for anything? If you don't respect what I might want, don't you at least owe me the truth? Why did you make a copy of me? You are the copy. What? Yeah. You, my dear, are a humanoid. A masterpiece, indistinguishable from the original. You are the copy. I have created you as a replacement for my late wife, Elena, you see. The tank in the other room is where you've been born and raised, all while your consciousness was living in an artificial reality. Now you will stay right where you are, 
Anna. Until I return home. And then I will reboot you. And put you back in the tank!